We are all aware of the importance of having values. But is it important to know the relative value of our values? Is it important to know which value has more value? This speaks to our portion, Parshas Matos. The Torah discusses the episode in which the tribes of God and Reuven approached Moshe with the following proposal. They agreed to help their brothers conquer the land of Eretz Israel, but they wished to settle in the land of the Aver Hayazin, in the land of the Transjordan, because they felt that that land was, sup was superior, more suitable for their abundant livestock. While they are away helping their brothers conquer Eretz Israel, they told Moshe that they will build pens for their livestock and fortified cities for their wives and children who will be behind. Moshe agrees to that proposal, but counters that they should first make arrangements for their children and wives who are behind, and afterwards make arrangements for their livestock. One could ask the following question of Moshe's correction. Why is it important which ones come first? They were planning, planning on doing both anyway. The answer is obvious. Moshe was pointing out that their value system was skewed. Sure, it is an important value to care for your property and livestock. But it is a higher value. It is more important to care for your family. Why is it important to know which value is more important? Moshe was pointing out that it is important to know the relative value of these two values in order to make a proper decision when these two values come into conflict. What should one choose when faced with a decision that will entail sacrificing time with family in order to make more money? This concept of weighing the relative value of two values is so important and so common in our modern life. We are constantly faced with a host of issues that require balancing two, two important values. The following are several examples from recent headlines. Number one, balancing the value of retrieving the bodies of dead, of dead soldiers versus, the potential, versus potentially putting other soldiers in harm. Number two, the value of pursuing of giving lands in the pursuit of peace versus the obligation to settle Eretz Israel. Number three, with regard to the federal wire, wiretapping issue, the value of privacy and civil liberty versus the value of national security. And with regard to the issue of building a fence along the Mexican border, the value preserving of protecting our borders versus the value of protecting the ecosystem. In each of these issues, both sides both sides are important values. The burning question, however, is which value is more valuable? Moshe is telling us that knowing the relative weights of your values is so important when making a decision when two values come into contact. It is, it is your scale of values, the way you measure competing values, that will ultimately determine the choices you, you make in life. How can one determine the relative value? Well, in the words of Hillel to the convert, Zil Gemara, go and study. Have a wonderful Shabbos. So with all my heart and soul, let me honor you. Gentle people with a faith of steel You teach the world how to live and how to give and how to believe If I could look into your heart I would see the face of God